the definition of an ultra marathon is crisis management. Since you don't run into just one or two walls, rather into wall after wall after wall, you break through every time and you learn a great deal, a great deal about yourself that you can do a lot better than you think and it's empowering. If I don't get through that wall, if I don't climb over it, I anticipate the feeling I have afterwards. And I'm honest with myself. And I know I'll disappoint myself, especially myself, forget about the other people. And I don't like the feeling of failure I get. That's why at the moment of truth, I try to give it my all. In order to deal with the difficulties of training, I adapt a technique or style which enables me to go on without stopping. I decrease my stride and reduce my speed to a light jog. Lift up my head and look ahead. I count the rounds, the curves, the uphills, and tie myself. Running in dunes and in sand is by definition difficult. The ground is unstable and even soft, and it requires a greater physical effort from us. Training on sand means leaving the comfort zone, and it's important to create diversity and run in challenging routes conditions. Lots of runners say, I train because of the feeling I get afterwards. You need to keep in mind that even though it's hard now, later will be fun, later will be wonderful, later I'll feel content. And I know that we often want things right here and right now, immediate gratification. And it doesn't work that way in life, it really doesn't. So you need to be constantly aware that later will be even better.